My favorite time, it's time to dish. And Karina Curiel from Casey's Kitchen Prepared Food and Catering is with me right now. We're going to put some pep in everybody's step with a no-bake recipe that looks kind of easy. Easy, healthy, and good. All right. Very so mo the most important. That's everything, huh? Yes, okay. this is everything. Eight ingredients. You could help me, Eden. This oh. is half, um, half a cup, one okay. cup of oatmeal. So this is already measured. I can yes. put it all in? Yes, okay. put it all in. All right. Then we have two-thirds cup of coconut flakes. Okay. So easy, even I And can. then you're going to do the half a cup of chocolate chips. Ooh, that's part of the energy, I'm sure. And then we're going to do a half a cup of the um, flax. Flax, okay. What are some of the good things about flax? Flax is a great omega-3. And this okay. is an organic golden flax. And two tablespoons has 28 milligrams of omega-3s and four grams of fiber. Oh, wow. So here we are with our peanut butter. That's the sticky. That's the sticky. And there's good fat and protein in that. Yes. Okay, that I know. And then and this, we have our chia seeds. Chia seeds. And that is massive nutrients, low calorie. Okay. It has one ounce, has 11 grams of fiber as well. Oh, wow. And in this recipe, we are putting in, um, oh, I can't see what it is. A lot that's of chias. Oh, A lot of chias. Okay. And then the last thing is honey. Okay. So yeah, we're, uh, let me do that okay, because good. that's the sticky part. Yeah. So all, right. all you have to do now is mix all of this together. So what would these be great for as far as like, you know, is it a dessert? Is it a meal replacement? Is it kids lunch? What, I, I think the best thing is is that evening sweet time craving because they're so rich and just sweet and you only need one. And then also after school snack for kids is also mm -hmm. a great avenue for these. So all you have to do is mix these up real uh -huh. good, put them in the fridge, let them sit. And then here you go. You just scoop just them out roll them up. and roll them out. They're I done. just use a scoop. I put one scoop and then I make a little roll and then awesome. That's all you need. And you could do some good bowl licking with this too. There's no, nothing in there Spoon that's wrong. Licking. Spoon licking right? is good. It always is good to make sure that the product tastes great by Rance the time. Is, Rance is laughing, but I know he wants to get his paws in here, don't you? Come on. I know you do. So, yeah. Okay, so it does have to chill though, otherwise it's yeah. not going to get that good. So when you're, that. yeah. There you go. He could give us the first time. I just like, instead of using a spoon, it's easier to just see how it's starting yep. to form together now. Mm -hmm. Use your hands. Well, and, it's, it's uh, a great recipe because it, it is Put it all no together. Big. Put it in the refrigerator, and you are ready to go. Love Easy, it. Easy, eight ingredients, simple. At Casey's Kitchen, we always use simple, whole, fresh ingredients. So then that way, our meals are healthy and um, good for you. Okay, and people can reach you at? www.kc2go.com. All right, very good. Easy. That is great. And Mark. 